um, it was good. I have I have some English lesson lesson and an art lesson. Oh, an art lesson, yeah. So how was it? Did you had an exam? Uh, no, I haven't. But uh, on the on the map on the map on map uh, at this afternoon, I have we have a mini test. Hmm, I see. Yeah. So today is Saturday, and um, are you still going to school tomorrow? Um, no, I no, I am uh, no, I am not because tomorrow. Because tomorrow my my school have to do something and we can uh, we can uh, stay at home. We oh. don't. Need to. Wow! I see. So you will you will just stay at home tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So what's your plan for tomorrow? Um, I think uh, I will sleep and tomorrow I will I will go to my hometown. Mm, your hometown. Yeah. Wow. So, how long is your hometown? Um. Uh, it's uh eighty kilom eighty kilometers, eighty kilometers far from there. Oh, that's a little far. Yeah. So you think yeah. it's a little far? Um. Yes, I do. Mm, yeah. All right. So today, Nyat, we're going to have our uh, lesson, and let me share my screen. So, oh, how about now? Can can you um, see yes, it I... now? Um. Yes, I can. I can see All it. All right. Yeah. So today, we're going to talk about fossils and about um past something that came from the past. So if, when we're talking about past what comes first to your mind um i think that the dinosaur fossils are some uh, are some uh, uh old human fossils mm, very good so what do you mean by fossils uh, i think that fossil is a skeleton or a type of uh the stone that uh look that uh in the is like a that is like a dinosaur or any any animal in the in the past mm -hmm. wow yeah very good so have you seen a fossil before um yes i have i have seen uh, some fossils in the in the museum. Mm, so, what kind of fossil is it? It's the old human fossil. Wow! I see. All right, there you go. Yeah, usually you can see that in the museum. So now let's take a look at this, and you're going to read about black beauty. So look at the photos on the panel have you seen this kind of fossil before um yes i have i have mm. seen a, a, a type of fossils before wow so where did you see this kind of fossil um we can we i i have seen uh this type of mass this type of massive must be in the must be in a dinosaur media. Mm, I see. All right. So now we're going to listen about Black Beauty. So the name of that fossil is Black Beauty. Yeah. Listening fifty one. Read and listen. Black Beauty. What is this? This is Black Beauty, a fossil of a Tyrannosaurus rex. There are about 50 Tyrannosaurus rex fossil skeletons in the world. Can you find these things in the fossil? 
a very big head, some big teeth, two small legs, two big legs, a very long tail. Okay, let's read first about what is Black Beauty or who is Black Beauty? Uh, Black Beauty is a fossil of a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, very Rex. good. So, uh, uh, my... Tyrannosaurus Rex, Rex fossil skeleton in the world. Yeah, all right. So how about in Vietnam? Are there or is there any Tyrannosaurus Rex fossil? Um, I think that there are some because because uh in the in that in the museum I have visited that uh that a fossil like this. Oh, I see. So does it have a very big head? Uh yes it yes it has. Yes wow. it does. Does it have some big teeth? Uh no it teeth uh is near nearby but it isn't on in the fossil. Mm. Does it have two small legs? Um yes, yes it does. There are two small legs in on the on the on the 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 total part part the total part the total of its body. Mm, or the front of yes. its body. Okay. So does it have two big legs? Um yet it does. It has two big legs in yeah. on the back. Very good. So next, it, does it has a very long tail? Um, yeah, it, yeah, it does. Yes, it does. So what are the other characteristics of Tyrannosaurus rex fossil that you see that you saw? Uh, I saw that it has a big body. Mm -hmm. Big body. And a big mouth. Yeah. How about its tongue? Uh, tongue of Tyrannosaurus. I think there's no tongue in the uh, fossil because it's the it's tie of the muscles from it, so it will be uh will be uh uh disappear by the material in, inside the uh, inside the dirt and mm -hmm. stone wow very good so you know a lot of science all right so next let's see who found dinosaur fossils or who, who finds, finds dinosaur fossils scientists usually dig for dinosaur fossils but two boys found black beauty in 1980 they found a big black bone by a river in Alberta, Canada. They took it to their teacher. She saw it was a fossil. She sent a letter to the Royal Tyrrell Museum. Then Dr. Philip Curry dug up the skeleton. Okay, let's learn who finds dinosaur fossils. Um, I think that uh, two boys found the the black beauty dinosaur fossil. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good. But usually, who are the people who digs or find dinosaur fossils? Uh, in 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 usually scientists uh usually dig for dinosaur fossils. Yes, very good. So have you imagined yourself also digging for dinosaur fossils in the future? 
Um, I don't think so because I don't want to be a historical scientist. Mm, I see. All right. So you don't want to be part of science. Yeah. Mm, all right. There you go. So now let's continue. Where did they find the black beauty fossil? Uh, they they found the black beauty fossil uh, by the river in Alberta, Canada. Yeah, very good. Wow, that's a little really really far. So let's see what is T Rex fast facts. T Rex fast facts. When? 65 to 70 million years ago. Where? North America and Asia. Diet. Meat. Size. 12 meters long and 4.6 to 6 meters tall. Weight. About 8,160 kilograms. T-Rex had 50 to 60 big teeth. Some were the size of bananas. Oh, I see. So again, where did they find the black beauty? Um, they found the black beauty in Alberta, Canada. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good. So when it was, uh, when it was seen? Um, it was seen when it, it was seen in about 65 or 7, 70 million years ago. Wow, that is a very long time. And what do they eat? Um, they eat meat. Yes. What's their size? Uh, their size are, the, are about uh, 12 matches, matches long and 4.6 4. to 6 matches tall. Oh, very good. And how many teeth do they have? Does it have? Uh, they have, they have, uh, it has about 50 to 60 big teeth. Wow. So uh, what's the size look like? Uh, this this size are uh, like a banana. Oh, so usually a banana will be like this. So it's a little big. And what's the weight? Uh, the its weight is about eight thousand one hundred sixty kilograms. Wow, so heavy. All right, so let's read our values. Uh, you can learn in a lot of different places. Yeah, in the different places. So first, the one place that we can learn is the museum. What other place we can learn more? We can learn at school, um, at the park, near the river, or uh, sometime on a um, on a field. Mm, on a field. Yeah. Yes. All right. Yeah. So there are so many places that we can learn, and today we're going to talk about culture. So, uh, yeah, tell me about Vietnamese culture. Some of the famous um, Vietnamese culture. Uh, there are some like uh, Han Kiem, like uh, uh, by biting, biting uh, pagoda, biting pagoda, Hương pagoda, uh, Hong River, uh, Hương River and uh thailand mm, i see yeah good you know a lot of cultures now we're going to listen to samuel and say what three things did he do 
at the Dinosaur Provincial Park. So, Listening 52. there are only three. Listen to Samuel. Hello, Samuel. What did you do at the weekend? I went to the Dinosaur Provincial Park. It was amazing. Did you know they found 50 different kinds of dinosaur in the park? 50? That's a lot. Did you find a dinosaur fossil? <laughs> no, of course not. Scientists do that. Oh, well, did you see any fossils? Yes, I did. We went on a safari. A fossil safari. Oh, what's that? We went on a walk with a guide. Oh, yes. Was it fun? Yes, it was. There were lots of fossils. There were fossils of fish, mammals and dinosaurs. Fish, mammals and dinosaurs. Fantastic. What else did you do? We went in a kayak on the Red Deer River. We saw some birds. Fossils? No, real birds. Then we went to the visitor centre. I know the visitor centre. It's great. Did you like it? Yes, I did. We watched a video. A video? What was it about? It was really interesting. It was about dinosaurs and fossils. I learned how a fossil is formed. That sounds great. So it was a good day. Yes, it was brilliant. Okay, so among these four lists, what three things did Samuel do at the Dinosaur Provincial Park? Uh, Samuel uh, have, have seen di dinosaurs, uh, have saw dinosaur fossil bones, uh, learned about fossils, and went for a walk. Wow, very good. All right, so this time there's another question here. So how many different dinosaurs did they find in the park? Uh, they found about 50 different dinosaur fossils in the park. Yeah, so who went for a walk with Samuel? Uh, I think that his guide went for a walk with Samuel. Yeah, right, the tourist guide or the museum guide. What did they see on the river? Uh, they saw a real bird. Mm, yeah, and what did they do at the visitor center? Um, I think that it, they, they, uh, they, they did some like they watch a movie about dinosaur and fossil. Yeah, very good. And for example, Nyat, you're going in a museum. What is the first thing that you will do? Um, I will come to to see uh, about what I like about uh, what I like in a museum, like the fossil or some or some old book. Mm, yeah, very good. So now let's continue. What can you describe an object from the past in your country? Uh, that think, uh, object is the uh, is the uh, old old stone I by the old old human used in the past. Mm. I see. So what's that stone all about? That I, is just a stone. There's a stone that, uh, that was used for a lot of things like uh, that. That was used for a lot of things like like uh, like uh, Climb a tree for for the fruit on that. Uh, cut down a tree, and sometimes sometimes to uh, protect protect the protect the uh, themselves with 
uh, without the the uh, dangerous animals like tiger or uh, lion. Oh, very good. Yeah. So, uh, do you think there are more objects from the past in Vietnam? Um. Yes, I do. I see. Yeah, we can learn all about that in the history class. So now let's answer the first review. Listening. Review. Yeah. Let's practice grammar. Lily is going to go to a museum tomorrow. What's she going to do there? What she's going to do there? Uh, she's going to watch the solar system. I think that. Mm, I see. Ah, yeah, it's somehow similar. Say a sentence. About planets. So blank okay. about planets. She learned about planet. Oh, all right. So let's see. She learned about planets. She's going to learn about planets. All right. So let's read again. Uh, she's going to learn about planets. All right. She's going to because it's in the future tense. She's still not doing it. Yeah, she's still in not in the museum. It's the the question is um, what will she do? So it's in the future. Correct. Say another sentence. Hmm. Uh, she she's she. going to uh, go in the go to the gift shop. He or she. Uh, he, he. Me. All right. So let's let's see if your answer is correct. He. She's going to visit the gift shop. Correct. Oh, so we're still talking about Lily. So let's read again. She's. Uh, she's going to visit the gift shop. Yeah. Very good. She's going to visit the gift shop. All right, so let's continue. Say another sentence. We're still talking uh, about Lily. Uh, she isn't going to copy a painting. Mm, isn't. She isn't going to copy a painting. Correct. Say another sentence. Uh, she isn't going to dig up bones. Bones. Okay, let's see. She isn't. She isn't going to dig up bones. Correct. Say another sentence. She uh, is she's she going isn't. to. Uh, she is going to take a tour. She's going to go on a tour. Again, she's going to go. Uh, she's going to go on a tour. Yeah, right. Correct. Say another sentence. Okay, another one. Uh, she's going to watch a video. Oh. She's going to watch. She's going to watch a video. She's going to watch a video. Correct. All right. So how about you, Nyat? What are you going to do tomorrow? 
um, I'm going to visit my hometown. Mm, all right. What are you going to do on Monday? Um, I'm going to go to school and meet again my friend. Wow, I see. So what are you going to do if, uh, if you are in a museum? Um, well, I'm going to watch the, the uh, uh, visual of all the things in the past. Mm -hmm. I see. You will uh, look, look at it. So what are you going to do if you are in a library? Um, I'm going to borrow some book and read them. Yeah, yes, that's great. What are you going to do if you are in, hmm, in a cafe? I'm going to order a drink and drink that. Okay, drink. yes, that's it. What are you going to do if you are in, at school? Um, I'm going to learn with my, uh, with my teachers and play with my friends mm. in the break time. Yes. What are you going to do when you got back home? Um, I am going to do my homework. Yeah. What else? And I am going to look, look about what I will learn tomorrow. Wow, advanced reading. I see. So those are the things that you're gonna do in the future. That's why you uh, introduce the sentence as I'm going to. Any questions about future tense? Um, I think there are no, no questions. All right. So enjoy your vacation or short vacation going to your hometown and have a great weekend, yeah. Thank you so much. Yes, yeah. see you, Mr. Julie. Yeah, see you.